Why did our ancestors leave the trees? Millions of years ago, rough tectonic activity in East Africa changed the climate and replaced the rainforest with wide open savanna. We didn't leave the trees. The trees left us. It must have been scary for our defenseless, chimpish ancestors to be thrown into this confusing environment packed with big predators. It's very likely that this is one of the first innovations our ancestors ever had to make. Find a way to stay alive. But around three million years ago, some of them came up with a solution which changed them and the course of world history. They threw stones. On their own, early people would not stand a chance against a lion. But if they coordinated with others, they could unleash a shower of stones that cut the big cat into pieces. The invention was cooperation, and it turned the hunted into the hunter. The cooperative outbred the non-cooperative, so evolution began to favor those with a larger brain that could understand others and communicate better. Look in the mirror. Look carefully at the whites of your eyes. Chimpanzees and most other mammals have brown sclera, not white. Humans benefit from broadcasting our attention, clearly showing where our attention lies. If we spot prey, we want others to know so they can help us catch it. Such early cooperation set the stage for human evolution. As humans evolved, so too did the ways in which we work together. From hunting, to farming, to crafting and trading goods, and forming marketplaces and means of communication along the way. Humans are cooperative by nature, constantly making use of the knowledge and abilities of others. And that explains our success, from surviving in the wild to reaching out into space. Hey, check out these other great videos from Free to Choose Network. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get updated on episodes of New and Improved with me, Johan Norberg.